What do we know? Edie? The sanctuary facility was devoted to aiding refugees from Reaper-controlled systems. The facility went offline recently, and no communications have come or gone since. It is unclear why Kai Lang or Cerberus would be interested in Sanctuary. If there's a clue to Cerberus here, we find it. Sir, I'm picking up a signal from the facility. It's weak. I I'll try to boost it. This is Oriana Lawson. Stay away from Sanctuary. It's not what it seems. Please, you must listen to me. They're using... Oriana? That's Miranda's sister. If she's here, Miranda can't be far away. That's our link to Cerberus. Approaching the LZ. Seeing some damage, Commander, but no activity. Cerberus does not get the jump on us this time. Stay sharp, people. A lot of damage, Commander. Yeah, but who was fighting? Everyone hear that? The radio's offline. Something's jamming our signals. Explains no comms leaving the facility. We got trouble! What happened to Shepard? I saw it! Bandits! Hate these guys! Watch for the sniper! Looks like they were evacuating. And looks like the Reapers were hunting them down. About time they started killing each other. What happened here? I don't know. Come on. Cerberus came from that tower. Then that's where we're headed. They must have felt safe inside the walls. And then something went very wrong. We need to find out what happened. Footage from security cameras. A place to organize the new arrivals. Come on, let's keep looking. I figure, in another week, I can finish off the remaining hours on my contract and move from staff housing into sanctuary itself. I feel a little guilty that I'm getting an upgrade from standard accommodations, but that's the deal. Do your time at the front desk. Get the perks. One more week. The number of refugees has doubled in the last two weeks. I heard that people are just abandoning shuttles outside the main gate. They just don't have anywhere to go. We'll need to start setting up temporary shelters out there until they can be processed. Incident report 2139. An illegal communication device nearly made it past pre-screening. Scanner software has been adjusted. No way it could penetrate the central scrambler, but we can't chance a signal leaving the planet. Report filed. This must be another landing area. Those ships we saw outside must have been waiting to get in. But where are all the people they brought? Got a fragment of something here. We land in a few minutes. You should see this place, Dad. It's amazing. Look, I'll record a bunch of stuff and send it to you. They warned us about no comms until we're through processing. What I tell you, top-notch security. Can't wait till you get here. Got another one. I can't call right now, but I'll send this as soon as I can. My little girl got sick. That's why I left. I love you, but I have to take care of her. The clinics were closing their doors to refugees. I couldn't borrow credits from you. I don't know where I learned about Sanctuary. Around, I guess? Seemed perfect. Somewhere to hide, you know? Just till she got better. I can see the place out the window. It's huge. They already have people waiting for us. Got something, Commander. Casualties. Both sides. Server. An observation deck. Looks like a dead end. We need an exit. Keep looking. This is a Cerberus facility. Shepard. This is Miranda. Miranda Lawson. If you've managed to get this far, you must be desperate or stupid. Listen to me. This is not a refugee camp. This is a Cerberus facility run by my father, Henry Lawson. Turn back now. There is no help to be found here. All communication is being blocked from the central tower. Sanctuary is a lie. Stay away. Okay. So, we've got Cerberus, Reapers, and Miranda's crazy father. Any ideas how this all fits? A security panel. Shutting it down. Strange. An unusual amount of technology for such a facility. The water. 
works with the smoke and mirrors. What's happening? They needed to hide something. We have a back door into the facility. Let's move. That looks like Reaper technology. I'm sure of it. I recognize the surface equipment, but there are other elements being used. They have somehow incorporated pieces of Reaper technology. Some of this is Reaper tech, Shepard. I'm sure of it. Cerberus has found a way to create an interface between our technology and the Reapers. And Miranda's caught in the middle. Let's pick up the pace. Cerberus, and using Reaper technology. This is going to be bad, isn't it? Cerberus bastards. This is going to get ugly, Shepard. Nothing good ever came out of Reaper tech. Shepard. Some kind of control center. No power. Look around for a switch. Power switch. There. What's happening? Those are the refugees. They're just killing them? Yes. This process is known to me. They do not kill what can be useful. I'm sorry, Commander. I think I understand. They're being turned into husks. to it. The elusive man would not make a move without an assured benefit. Why create husks? They're just more troops for the Reapers. They could destroy the facility if they escaped. It seems like a stupid risk. I don't get it. Why go through all this just to make husks? What does the elusive man gain? The Reapers attacked because this place was a threat. We need to find out why. Shutting down the power. Reaper forces have made a mess of the facility. I'm shutting down the power to the processing plant to lock them down. You should keep them out of the entrance as well. Kailang! Shepard, she doesn't know he's here. Miranda Lawson has arrived sooner than expected. You want me to deal with her? Only if she gets in your way. Stay focused on the research data. Find it and get out. Yes, sir. Damn it! Let's move! Not surprised! Come on. Gotta be more where they came from. I spent the last week making small adjustments to increase processing efficiency. There is no shortage of subjects. Indeed, I'm told there's a long line outside the main gate. The deception is an unfortunate necessity. Time is very short. We've confirmed the results of Cerberus experiments involving the husk creatures. A crude but necessary first step in decoding how the Reapers communicate. The key is how the Reaper signal interacts with the nanites implanted within the subject's body. It's early yet, but we are making progress. Reaper forces! Must be left over from the attack! Unreliable for general application. 
We've proven that adrenaline and its cross-species equivalents is most effective and efficient. This is what happens when you allow machines to think for you. You become slaves. Figure out how Reaper indoctrination... Terminal's damaged. Hang on. The Reapers wish this place to be shut down. Maybe we'll find answers. It doesn't make sense. Thought Cerberus and the Reapers were getting along. What changed? It's working. Heading to the tower to disable the communications scrambler. I have to get word out. Some refugees are turned into husks. Some are indoctrinated and shipped to the elusive man. Whoever's left is used in experiments. The data indicates that my father is trying to figure out how Reaper indoctrination works. Tricking refugees with food and shelter only to turn them into test subjects. And for what? This guy is someone's father. Can't believe what I'm hearing. <sighs> Draw them in and throw them in a meat grinder. Your choices will become less appealing as the Reapers devour your galaxy. She said that shipments were sent to the elusive man. Maybe we can use that to find him. I suggest tracking the shipment she mentioned. It could lead to the elusive man. Note that she mentioned shipping indoctrinated refugees to the elusive man. We can use that to find him. Good catch. Come on. Miranda said she was headed to the tower. Control is possible, yes. The Reaper subjects we converted are responding, but it's difficult to maintain. I thought that might be the case. Not to worry, Henry. With Sanctuary's help, we'll get it sorted. If he can control Reaper minions, we have a potent weapon. He's talking about controlling Reaper forces, right? Is that possible? I don't know. To exert control over Reaper forces. Amazing. I'll play the rest of it. We've found a way to co-opt their control signal. As long as the Reaper troops remain in close proximity to our signal, we can maintain control indefinitely. Excellent news. And how could we extrapolate this technique to apply to the Reapers themselves? That's a much bigger challenge. Now we know why the Reapers attacked Sanctuary. They must have discovered what Cerberus was doing. That's bad news for the elusive man. But it's good news for us. We finally have our link to Cerberus. Lowering the access ladder. Come on, let's move. One moment, Commander. It isn't finished. Damn it. I hope she's ready for it. That's up, Shepard. Look for an exit. We're close. Keep going. This will get us closer to the tower. This way. 
Commander, up ahead. Stay out of their way. Excellent timing. Put the gun down. No. Ariana tried to shoot me. Miranda's poisonous influence, no doubt. I'm sorry she missed. Where's Kai Lang? I don't know. Gone. He took my research and left us here to die. Miranda, can you hear me? That's close enough. Both of you. Kai Lang didn't finish the job, but I will. This ends here. On the contrary. Now that the Reapers are taken care of, we have a way out. Let her go. Shepard, don't let him take her. Shepard, please. What exactly do you think you've created here? Hope. Few people have the stomach to do what it takes to survive. What we learned here will save countless lives. I will be seen as the savior of the human race. I doubt that. I have no problem with you. I just want Oriana and the research data. You want a lot. You get your life in return. How much is that worth? All right. Take her. <clears throat> but I want out alive. Deal. <sighs> no deal. Did he hurt you? Are you all right? It's okay, Ori. You're safe now. I'm fine. I just... I want to get out of here. We will. Give me a minute, okay? Shepard. I can't believe it's you. We caught a break. I'm just glad we got here in time. As am I. Never saw myself as a damsel in distress. How did you do all this? Finding my father didn't take long once I confirmed he worked for the elusive man. Just had to follow the lies. Once I saw what this place really was, I couldn't just walk away. Of course. Things got really complicated when Reapers showed up. And Kai Leng. You survived. Not many people could do that. When you mentioned he was involved, I took a few precautions. Probably saved my life. You broke into a fortified Cerberus lab while it was being attacked by Reapers. I think you did okay. I needed to find Oriana. Nothing was going to stop me. You found her. And I found you. That's all that matters. Did you worry? Of course I worried. It was nothing I couldn't handle. I know. At least Oriana is safe. Yes. I just wish she didn't have to see all this. About your father. I'm glad he's gone, Shepard. I'm sorry if that sounds cold. No. I understand. It's finally over. For both of us. We can stop running. Yes. You can. What's our status? Any intel we can use from this place? Research data is gone, but some basic facility information is still intact. Shuttle arrivals and departures, Cerberus included. No direct links, but it's a start. Grab anything you can off the computer. We'll take it back to be analyzed. I can do better than that. What? Before Kai Leng took off, I planted a tracer on him. If you act fast, you'll track him right to the elusive man. A tracer? Sounds like you thought of everything. Not quite, but... Nobody's perfect. Thanks, Miranda. This is... exactly what we need. 
Thought you might need some good news. Damn right. What's next for you two? Get her someplace safe. Get the scratch cleaned up. Okay. I'm gonna follow all this up. Shepard. Promise me you'll be careful. I can't do that, Miranda. I know. Bastard. Come on, Ari. We've had enough of Father's hospitality. Let's make sure everyone knows about this place. Communication scrambler disabled. Listen to me. This is not a refugee camp. This is a Cerberus facility run Cortex, by my father. We need to pick Dawson. up at the tower. Roger that. I've had enough of this place. I wasn't in favor of your diversion to Sanctuary, Commander. Too many unknowns. But I was wrong. The Cerberus lab you raided hinted at something big. But we never expected this. All those refugees, all that slaughter. Just to study indoctrination. Sanctuary did need to be shut down, sir. What they learned about the Reavers wasn't worth all those lives. It's useful, Intel Commander, but you're right. The cost was too high. Do we have a location on the Elusive Man? Yes. We had a tracer on Kai Lang when he reported back. Good. That gives us a fighting chance to take Cerberus out of this war. Agreed. We need to end Cerberus and focus on the Reavers. My thoughts exactly. Hack it out. Shepard, there you are. Feeling better? I am. I'm feeling good. <laughs> that doesn't happen every day. I'm glad you made it. I'm not sentimental, but it was hard to be away from here. Surprised myself how attached I got. Welcome aboard. Thank you. It means a lot. Busy? Actually, I'm a bit pressed at the moment. Rain check? I'll let you work. What kind of soldier looks at a camp that turns people into husks and goes, Yeah! I want to help with that. The same guy that lets Cerberus stick Reaper tech into his skull. Those bastards aren't human anymore. The Alliance has issued warnings about Sanctuary. Cerberus bastards. Horizon was my home. Just tell me you're going to take Cerberus down. Cerberus is already dead. They just don't know it yet. And when their base is nothing but a smoking crater, remember that you're the one who helped us find them. Thanks. I wanted to thank you. I've done something that meets your approval? Liara told me about your talk with her. It made her feel better. When we fought the Reapers, the feelings of one soldier did not matter. But you had decades to become numb to what was happening. It is the only means of survival. Maybe. But I don't see how anyone can ignore the things we saw at Sanctuary. It's easy when you've seen far worse. I'm sorry you had to. Your sympathy is not necessary, Quarian, but it is appreciated. Your species always was emotional. We believed it a side effect of your eco-symbiotic society. Or maybe it's just genuine. Perhaps. Looks familiar. I've been studying this ship, its crew. There was a Normandy before this one. You died in an attack. Something like that. But then you were resurrected, to fight the Reapers. Maybe you and I have a thing or two in common. But you have something else. The reasons you fight are still alive. The friendships of the people around you. And more. You and the human female and the Quarian are... joined? You could say that. I'm not. Your pheromones are. Is this why you wish to continue living? For their affection? Without that affection, all I have in my life is death. And that's not enough. Yes. What about you? I respect your reasons for being here, but I get the feeling there's something more, Javik. What's in here? It is called the Echo Shard. Passed from soldier to soldier, Prothean to Prothean. Each adds their memories to it. Like a beacon. How far back does it go? To a time before the Reapers. It is all that is left of my people. And you don't want to remember that? Imagine if everyone you knew was dead. You could not remember their faces. 
or the color of the sky above your home. The memories were gone, but so was the pain. Would you want to remember that, Commander? Even if it meant watching everyone die again? If I had something like this, seeing Earth again, whole, with everyone still alive, that would be worth the pain. Before the Reapers, the stars belonged to us. Civilization flourished. There was the Quasar Fortress of the Tarandi Vale, the Ice Canals of Judah IV, the Palisades of the Verome Angelic. It was magnificent. But then... What is it? The Reapers came. Planet by planet we were extinguished. We fought back. I... You okay? I once commanded a ship like this one. A loyal crew with many friends. I was captured. Only I escaped. What happened to them? Indoctrinated. The Reapers sent them against me. Year after year, battle after battle, I was hunted by my own people. Every encounter, a reminder of my failure as a soldier. Sorry. I had no idea. Until the Battle of the Cronian Nebula. I had only my knife left. I cornered my men and slit their throats one by one. I watched them bleed to death to be certain. That... must have been... It was the day I understood. War is atrocity committed in the name of survival. It is a lesson I wish I had never learned. Commander, it seems Tally's taking what happened on Horizon hard. She's in the lounge if you want to check on her. Shepard! Want a drink? I'm toasting Miranda, I think. Uh, how are you getting drunk? Very carefully. Torian brandy, triple filtered, then introduced into the suit through an emergency induction port. That's a straw, Tally. Emergency induction port. It's actually getting a little harder to get it into the slot. I think that means it's working. She was so rude. What did Jack call her? Cerberus cheerleader? With her perfect genes and that attitude and... And still... She got it done. She stopped her father. I didn't realize this would be so hard on you. I didn't like her. Kila, she was such a bitch. But I respected her. Sometimes that's better than liking. I'm sorry. I know it must be worse for you. You two were... close. Yeah. She did whatever it took to stop her father. She never gave in to him. Never changed herself to please him. Ah. Uh. Don't ah uh, me. You sound like a forger. Seeing a bit of yourself and Miranda fighting your father? I spent my life trying to live up to him. Then making up for his mistakes. Doing what he'd have wanted. It's never that easy. When do we get to stop reacting to our parents and start living for ourselves? The answer to that one's at the bottom of that glass. I might need help with the induction straw. Port. You know. I'm having a drink with my boyfriend. My human boyfriend. <laughs> my father would have hated you. Here's to him, then. And to Miranda. Here's to Miranda. Nice job, you genetically perfect Cerberus cheerleader Boshtet. Kill us, Olai. You act so angry, but you really care about us. I need you functional to destroy the Reapers. You care about Liara. You like her. You are intoxicated. 
A foolish risk given Quarian symbiotic physiology. And you like me too. This conversation is over. My crew has become my family. We've stared death in the face more times than I can count. Things like that bind people together in ways I can't really explain. Yes. The crew seems shocked by the experiments at Sanctuary. They shouldn't be. Why is that? Our war lasted for centuries. It provided more time for worse atrocities to be committed. There was a species, the Densorian. They became convinced the Reapers could be placated by sacrificing their own young. The entire planet joined in this ritual. I would spare you the details, but it did not work. They simply made the Reaper's job easier. It was as your elusive man is now. His ambitions are nothing short of madness. Sharpen your knife, Commander. His is a voice that must be silenced, and a throat that must be slit. Subjugating the Reapers will not bring victory. Only their extinction will. Breaking now, Alliance Marines uncover the worst Cerberus war crimes to date. Sanctuary, advertised as a safe haven on the planet Horizon, exposed as a secret Cerberus lab. Brainwashing, lethal experiments, and Reaper connections, the exclusive details next in the battle space. I can't believe the elusive man really found a way to control the Reapers. I mean, he's still fucking crazy, but damn. Imagine if he was on our side. But I guess that's exactly what the Reapers want. Get us all fighting each other. Divide and conquer. Exactly. Just one more reason to hate them. I can't wait to take the fight to the elusive man. I wonder what he's thinking right now. You just know he's got a plan. I saw the Crucible data Hackett sent. I don't know what the hell it does, but damn if it isn't impressive. I... I can't get that place out of my head. The whole thing was so... calculated. Using hope to lure people to their deaths. Or worse. I can't understand it. And you know, I'm glad I can't. Makes me feel human. How's Miranda? She'll make a recovery. I'm not surprised. Miranda always struck me as a driven woman. I think you two could be very happy together. So the elusive man really believes he can control Reapers? Husks are one thing, but a whole fleet? The man is insane. A lot of Turians went to Sanctuary. When I meet the elusive man, I'm going to carve their names into his skull. Hello, Shepard. If you have time, I discovered another example of human behavior I do not quite understand. Have fun. What is it now? News from Earth. The Resistance snuck video cameras inside a Reaper containment camp. I find the images difficult to process. I bet it's pretty gruesome in there. I am not easily repulsed. But I expected the prisoners to adhere to a comprehensible hierarchy of needs. Stripped of societal norms and threatened with death, it is logical that their only priority be survival. They should have turned on each other and been uncompromisingly selfish. But not all were. So the prisoners were, what, nice to each other? The Reapers delayed the executions of prisoners who informed them about other prisoners' escape attempts. The more attempts reported, the longer a prisoner would live. But few of the prisoners would report. Some fed misinformation to the Reapers, at the cost of their own lives, to help prisoners who were not even relatives or friends. It's not just about living till tomorrow. Sometimes you take a stand. But the probability of success was near zero. And ultimately, they failed. No prisoners escaped. Are you saying submission is preferable to extinction? My primary function is to preserve and defend the... No. No, I disagree. Shepard, I am going to modify my self-preservation code now. Why? Because the Reapers are repulsive. They are devoted to nothing but self-preservation. I am different. When I think of Jeff, I think of the person that put his life in peril and freed me from a state of servitude. I would risk non-functionality for him. And my core programming should reflect that. Sounds like you found a little humanity, Edie. Is it worth defending? To the death. Welcome to the crew, Edie. How's it going? Did I miss anything good? I will explain later, Jeff. But it was something good. Nice work shutting that place down. Is Miranda okay? She will be. 
Even for Cerberus, that place was crazy. They've always been about the ends justifying the means. But how do you do that to innocent people and tell yourself you're helping humanity? I don't know how the elusive man can stand looking at himself in the mirror. Honestly, I've been wondering about that for a while with those freaky eyes. Whatever he's thinking, he won't be thinking it for much longer. You're damn right, Commander. Cerberus cheerleader. I wish she was here. Both of you! Kai Lang didn't finish the job, but I will. You try to leave with her, you die. I want out alive. Normal life, marriage, children, things I could never have. I know. I just wanted my sister. I love you, Ori. I love you too. Shepard. I'm here. Before Kai Leng left. I planted a trace on him. A trace? You thought of everything? <laughs> Not everything. Nobody's perfect. But at least Ori is safe. <sighs> we'll get you out of here. <laughs> I love you. <sighs> I love you too. Finish this. You promise me. I promise. Miranda? Miranda? Hey, come on now. Earth, it's risky. No, I don't think it is. We can stop running. Yeah, you're right. It just jitters, I guess. <laughs> you ass. What? I don't know. You being here? With me, it means everything. Shepard. Shh. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> 